I, you will recall that I made a pledge last year after watching the Kenya-Uganda match at Nyao Stadium in Nairobi uh, to mobilize uh, over 2,000 supporters for the return match in Kampala. The game ended in a draw, as you recall, with our boys putting up a very exciting and invigorating display against our Ugandan neighbors. And you recall that, that was... I want to urge Kenyans to be positive thinkers. Mimi naona hakuna haja ya kulalamika tena kama jamii ya wananchi wa Kenya. Ukilalamika, shetani anafurahia sana na kupiga na malalamisha tazaidi kwa mlalamisho wa maisha. So positive thinking. If you want to be great, you have to be a positive thinker. Na ndio mimi nawashukuru sana wana fans hawa. Kwanza kwa kunifanya patron wa Kenya Football. Um, Football Fans Association and mekubali kabisa kwa zwa mimi kweli mimi ni mwanakadanda I believe it or not I actually am a very good player so this is why we are here to make good that pledge after the match I was convinced that Kenyan football is on the rebound and if supported the national team and indeed our clubs can break back the glorious past that Kenya was actually famed for and I agree with the mayor that it is important to really do this election. Uh, it has been on for too long. Wajandae wafanye uchaguzi. Wachagua ambao ni wapenda kanda. Nambo some idea. Sio kufanya kama ni business fulani. Ili sasa tuanze kuona mpira wetu kinuka. My ambition is to see Kenya actually participating. Not in the too distant the future. In the World Cup. Because that is where we want to go. I barabara ya kuelekea Kampala ni barabara ata unajua 2014. 2014 itakuwa wapi? Rio. Ilikuwa mzema kama ingeweza kana tujiandai tuende kule. Our Ugandan brothers and sisters challenged us with their passion for their team. Kusema kweli uzalendo ulikuwa hali ya juu sana. And then they came in 72 hired buses. And they came to cheer their team. Mara tu nilikafikiria mimi kweli having worked so hard for the reinvigoration the the rebirth of the East African community nikaona ha this is wonderful I remember I negotiated for the protocol on the free movement of East Africans na nikaona waganda kweli wametushinda hapa wamekuja kwa wingi wamefurika hapa wametuvamia basi ni zamu yetu sasa kuenda kwa vamia wa ganda. Na kuonyesha kwamba this is the way East Africa. And whenever there will be a team playing in Dar es Salaam, mimi pia nitakuwa mtu wa kwanza kuenda kutambalea yule ndugu yangu yule. As you know, the return match is actually on 8th of October, barely a fortnight away. And we too must take full advantage of what a strong squad of supporters can do to motivate their team. And this is the reason we are here. Kenya, we all know, is a sporting giant with world beaters in many fields. Our athletes have done us exceedingly proud. So we are very proud of this kind of achievement. In soccer, we are seeing a resurgent Gormahia and AFC Leopards, Tumiona Hill, clubs that are household names locally, regionally, and even continentally. Others such as Sofapaka, where I'm the patron, and the Olinzi Stars. I've also joined the, the, uh, the stable of clubs that have helped to restore confidence in Kenya's potential to scale higher in our campaign to reach the World Cup. I strongly believe that uh, Kenya will one day play in the World Cup. But for this to happen, we must restore faith in ourselves by streamlining the management of soccer in our country, and therefore let there be orderly conduct of football affairs, which is why it's so important to sort out this election thing once and for all. Let me there, um, let there also be discipline among fans in order to weed out unruly behavior that only serves to spoil our country's hard earned reputation as a sporting powerhouse. I'm inspired to support the initiative to send thousands of fans to the return march in Kampala in the spirit of East African community. The ongoing, um, ongoing integration process within the East African community 
we eventually eliminate fiscal national bounder, boundaries, our borders, and allow free cross-border movement with attendant benefits to the peoples of East Africa. I urge that part of the impeding federation's agenda becomes promoting understanding and closer ties through friendly visits the road to Uganda one. Sporting and especially soccer has become an integral part of our social lives in the new world order. Soccer, for instance, has elbowed its way right into the center of the world of modern day careers as well as diplomacy and foreign relations. If you follow people like Fabregas, how much they were paid to move from one club to the other, you begin to see there's a real big money in soccer. Indeed, sporting must be put to the best use in bringing lasting peace to communities within our boundaries and between us and neighboring countries. Time to make regional and continental soccer one of the bridges to greater cooperation and the means to establishing firm brotherhood in, region, in the region and globally <clears throat> is actually now. At a time when white collar careers are lagging behind more talent based employment, I want to be counted among the forerunners in encouraging our youth and uh, to be able to harness their gifts and talents to improve the quality of their lives and lift prospects of a greater future for this nation. May I now announce my contribution of two million Kenya shillings to hire eight to 10 buses to ferry Kenya Football Fans Association to Uganda come the 8th of October 2011. So it is important as leaders, when we make pledges, we must honor them. So this is why I made this other pledge and it is in my character and uh, my responsibility is therefore to honor, to honor that pledge. I urge corporate bodies to join in and sponsor the remaining 50 bus loads of funds of a projected total of 60 to carry about 2,000 funds to Uganda. And in other words, anybody willing to come. I, I have a little dream. I see that the bus that I will board myself, itakuwa na wajumbe wengi sana. Titaanza, niliahidi kwamba I will flag you off from here or get uh, other friends to flag you, whoever is willing to flag, because I don't want to get credit for this one. And I mean it. I don't want credit. The only credit I want is for the country. So anybody willing, aje tu asione kama oh atini campaign tactic, akuna, there's nothing further from the truth. That's all right. However, this is it, and I mean it. Everybody should not feel inhibited. Nobody should feel excluded. Nobody should think this is a wiper initiative. It is not. Wiper taungea baadai after we come back from Kampala. But for now, let's all move to Kampala. I have now the pleasure in launching the road to Kampala. Thank you so much. <laughs> Yeah, I'm being. Hold on. Now, you can't see. When I say, "Go on, Papa," to go on a patron, we too to me sign. When you patron, to put your gun on me, we shoot. We fly. We can put your gun on me.